Have you seen our common sense conservative leader's brilliant 15 minute documentary on the housing hell in Canada that's been viewed over 4 million times? The conservative scheme on housing. I haven't watched the video itself. Okay, so I would strongly I would encourage that, that you do watch it because it's a common sense conservative plan how to build more homes and not more bureaucracy. And while you're at it, maybe like, share, and subscribe so <laughs> others can see a common sense conservative plan on how to get housing fixed as well. I'm happy to comment your, on the conservative your government's scheme today, housing in fact, your, your government's very happy housing to. agency, CMHC, says that 3.5 million additional homes need to be built in Canada by 2030 to restore housing affordability. Your housing agency, the same one, the head of that agency says that it said two days ago at the Senate Finance Committee that your government has no plan to reach that number. In fact, in this committee, that same agency, your housing agency, says that that target is not attainable under current conditions because of high interest rates and because of higher costs that were caused by your government. In other words, your own housing agency has no faith in you or your government. If your own housing agency has no faith in you, why should Canadians? Thank you for the question, Mr. Hallen. Uh you asked me to comment on the conservative scheme on housing. I, I didn't so ask you to comment so. on that. I made you, a comment. In, in fact, invited me to. So let me comment. I'd like to hear First an of all, I would point out... Point of order. Point of order. Mr. Halan, as he does every time the minister comes, asks a question or makes a statement and then refuses to allow the minister to answer. And so, Mr. Chair, I would just ask yeah, that we, ask allow, we allow the minister to answer the questions out of respect okay, for you. the minister and the other My members of the committee, but the also the folks at home who are watching who would like to hear the answers. The question uh, is about MP, Parker, 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 MP, MP Hallen, yeah. MP Hallen, I am going to ask, like it did happen in the last meeting, a lot of crosstalk, you jumping in when when you ask a question. The question allow, was about allow, the out, out of question was about You ask a question out of respect and out of respect respect to everybody that's here minister can you please MP Hallen, answer MP Hallen, why yeah. canadians the should minister, have faith in you mp Hallen. even though your housing MP Hallen, doesn't that's the question mp Hallen. I i've asked my question mp Hallen. you asked a question allow the witness to answer the question she's not witness did the witness did not even have a nanosecond to answer your question point, point of so, order mr chair not, order. not only is is that irrelevant and untrue and they're not asking and answering the question you shut me down the last uh, by adjourning the meeting improperly so could you please like conservatives speak i know you don't want to hear it as a liberal i know no. you don't want to hear about the housing hell M and you you're, you're, MP you MP should Lawrence. watch the video too i might add mp lawrence i i uh, chair I, i'll ask I, my I question again I, let's move on Hallett, i won't i'll ask MP my question Hallett. again it's my time chair <laughs> I will ask the question fact, again. Actually, actually, Minister, let me your just housing say, agency I, has I no faith. I believe in that your MP Allen asked me a Canadians? question. I, I certainly believe the point of this exercise is for him to ask me a question. He offered quite a Questions long on preamble the table, three with lots now. of points embedded in it. Why should and I'd like to respond to that. If, if MP Allen would like Allen, to hear a question. response. Allow the witness, please, to answer the questions. Yeah, I, I'd also like to point out that conservative senators have been reprimanded for bullying witnesses, and it would be terrible to have that kind of behavior. Your prime minister has been reprimanded for bullying strong women in his own caucus for standing up to his corruption. So, so let me let the, me now speak about housing, um, and let me first point out that there is an internal contradiction in what the conservative members of this committee have done when it comes to voting and their it's proposed irrelevant scheme to my on question. housing. Actually, Point I of believe order, that Mr. your Chair. votes are very Point relevant. There has to be, you have clear. to stop interrupting. Yeah. Stop yeah. interrupting. Yeah. Point. So I'll, I'll move point, on. I'll move on. I, I I'll, have move. I'll, move. I'll move on. It's my time, and I only no, have I'm, I'm afraid. Time. Actually, so, it's time for so questions and answers, Minister, MP Allen. So I would Minister, like to answer this because is the I have things why, to say this about housing. Exactly because the reason we have a plan. why your non-answer proves why Canadians and your own housing agency has no faith in your government. To point of order. The target. Point of order. Uh, what Under this what this proves order. what this proves is that the Conservatives do not want to actually listen to the answers. Not a point of order is. Excuse me. Excuse me. I, excuse me. I have listened to you interrupt the minister and not allow her to speak. That's I have the right order, to okay, make a point of order. Now I'm being interrupted and heckled during my point of order. Please, Chair, please, I'm asking you. Ms. Minister Freeland has the right to respond to this the questions not a that point are of order, put Mr. to Chair. And this is not, this Do is a point job. of order. Now I'm being heckled and interrupted. It's not a point of, point of order. This is a breach of process. This is, thank you. 